Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. I have a new frauditor for you today. In fact, so new, he's only been active for about a month, if that. And he goes by the name of Big West Audit. We catch up to him in Haskin, Ohio as he audits a post office and keep track of his personality traits. He seems to be a mixture of several different frauditors. So let's sit back, relax, and let's try to get a good laugh out of this guy. How's it going guys? Today we're back with another video. And I like this American flag right here, right off the rip. It says, welcome to Haskings. We're located here at Haskings, Ohio. We're about to go in the post office to see if they respect our First Amendment rights to report in public. If you guys haven't seen my other videos, go watch them all. Like, share, subscribe, comment. And have a great blessed day. America, baby. It's a nice little town here. Post office. Very small building. What are you doing, big guy? Hello. I'm just taking a video. Your what? Just taking a video. Of what? For what? Don't... My own purposes. For what? Why? Why? My own purposes? Yeah. Why are you taking a video of me and him? Yeah. I'm not, well, you guys are in you're the video not, now because you're talking, but I'm just taking a video of the post office. Well, you're not Why? supposed to do that. Hey, that's, this is, this yes, is. Yes, it's my, this, I'm, it's my right, sir. I'm just recording in public. It's a government office, son. This is a public building, sir. It's a government office. It's a oh, cop. Sir, this is a, the cops will tell you guys, this is a public building. I swear I'm going to wear this clip out to the point where it becomes its own cliche and thus a meme. So, Ass Elmo, go ahead and roll that beautiful bean footage. Photographs for news purposes may be taken in entrances, lobbies, foyers, corridors, or auditoriums when used for public meetings, except we're prohibited, okay? It's not pro prohibited here. There are a number of things you glossed over in that you didn't even complete the whole damn paragraph and what you did read, you glossed over. The most important part that you did read but totally ignored was the part when used for public meetings. And there are no public meetings going on right there. So you don't have the authorization to do that without the installation head, which covers the last half of the paragraph you did not read. I will read the last part of the paragraph for you then. Prohibited by official signs or security force personnel or other authorized personnel or a federal court order or rule, other photographs may be taken only with the permission of the local postmaster or installation head. Sorry about that, guys. I'm probably going to use that clip so much when it comes to post office audits. I've already got it sitting in my meme folder already. Ready to go and ready to use when needed. And I really appreciate Asimo for reading the first half of the paragraph, at least. He failed on the second half, though. I'm just here to make a purchase That's and I'll be on my way. That's some shit going on, I'll tell you that right now. I used to be what? a school what? teacher. Yeah. Yeah. A school yeah. teacher? Well, they don't make a lot of money. What? They don't make that much money. I don't want to be a teacher. I didn't, ask, I didn't ask you about that. I'm, I'm just right telling you. You believe this shit? Believe what, sir? Do you know the First Amendment? Shut up. Shut up? Hey, come on, man. Is that the way you talk to citizens of the public? He's a citizen too, you moron. He's a member of the public too, you idiot. If you want to show disrespect toward him because he was a school teacher, then he has every right to respond with in kind to what you said to him. You worthless pile of garbage. Of America? Yes. What's going on? Nothing, ma'am. I'm just here filming a video about the post office, and this man told me to shut up. Yeah, but you're not supposed to be filming in the post office. 
Do you guys have poster seven in here, sir? Because poster seven says you're allowed to film in a post office. If it is in there, I doubt that you would even have the mental capacity to understand every single word of that paragraph. Well, I'm going to be finding out. What's your name? Can I have an ID? Are you a police officer? Can I have he your ID? He wants your ID. Are Can you I a police officer? Can I have your ID? No. No. I cannot have your ID. Why would I have to provide you with my oh, identification? Everybody comes in the post office, sir. From the point exactly. It's a public building, ID. sir. I'm, I want to make a purchase. Oh, I'm the cops see what the cops say. The cops will tell you guys that I have the right to be here. Yeah. I'm just trying to make a purchase. Purchase of what? Did your parents have any children that live? Sir, yes, sir. How about they regret that? Oh, it seems like to me that the best part of you ran down your mother's leg and ended up as a stain on the mattress. I think you've been cheated. I'm buying some stamps. Are you? Yes. I'm waiting in line right now in a public building. All right. As long as you're in line doing business. Okay, thank you, sir. I don't know why this gentleman told me to shut up. That's not very polite. Uh, yes. But that's okay. Let it go. Because you have the freedom of speech. Let it go. Let it go? Yeah. You verbally assaulted me. Why are you screaming at me, sir? Oh, poor baby. Please stop yelling. No reason to yell at me. This is coming back to you. Right, and then this is to where it's going to go. Where it's going to go. There you go. Sorry, I made you upset, sir. I, didn't, I wish you wouldn't have yelled at me like that. Not here to record you, just the post office. Looking for poster seven. Do I have the right to be here, sir? You're not supposed to be filming in the post office, but... Yes, you can, sir. It's a public building. You can film in public. It's the First Amendment right. Oh, God. What a wacko. A wacko? Oh, yeah. Okay, keep, just keep... Okay, this is going to be your tracking. Right? Verbally assaulting yeah. me, that's fine. Never said nothing bad to you, sir. <laughs> Just here making a video about the post office. No reason to be upset or mad. Allowed to be here, we're allowed to record in the public building. Well, I can see, what's this town called again? Because I can see the citizens here are not that uh, friendly. Oh, Haskins. In Haskins, Ohio, the post office is not welcoming me. <laughs> Look at little Goblin Jr. I'm gonna cry. This is ridiculous. I was verbally assaulted by this gentleman right here with pink shorts on. I'm not seeing poster seven anywhere. You guys should get that out here. Poster 7 says you're allowed to film in a post office. Well, I'm just trying to educate you guys. Was this it right here? Recording presence. You want to read that, sir? Get away from me. I figured this guy had a problem with reading comprehension. He's pointing at the wrong part of the poster. At least ass almost got this part down right. I'm six, I'm six, feet, distance. I'm six feet distance. I'm just trying to show you the rules and law right just here. Get away from me. Okay, I will. I'll stay back. Just waiting in line to make my purchase. I don't know why you're being so rude. I'm just, you're not educated. For your age, I thought you'd be a little more educated on the law and the First Amendment, but I guess not. Who is he? He's an asshole, sir. Well, that's fine. Okay, there you go. Here's you learn something new every day. Okay. And I hope you learn. Thanks. Look at the First Amendment law, Sorry. sir. R right to report in public. Hello, sir. How are you doing today? I'm doing great. 
How are you doing? Good, how are you? You want to buy stamps? Yes, please. Can I get two stamps? Two? Yes. Dollar twenty. Thank you. Your name is Eric? Uh, that's, my, that's my name, Eric. Okay, thank you, sir. Yep, here's... You guys ever had anyone come in here and do this? No, that's why okay. I'm That's it, why I'm reacting did, way. Did, you call, never had did you call the police? Huh? Did you guys call the police? No, I didn't. Is there anyone else in the building with higher authority, like a postmaster? Nope, I'm the it. Okay, well, I, I want to say, sir, I thank you for not calling the police and jumping to a conclusion. I was honestly just coming to you guys' town. I was going to make I was gonna make a little story on the post office. I'm allowed to be here and record in public. You guys have a poster, poster 7, that says I can record and be in public. Dumbass! You dumbass! You're a dumbass! Such a dumbass! You're an ass! Recording. I apologize that that gentleman was upset. I'm, I hope you're not upset to be on camera, but you guys work for the public, and... You're not expecting privacy in public. And I'm just making a story about the post office. And there's nothing against... You did a great job, Eric. I want to say thank you for your service for the United States Postal Service. Thank you so much. You're a great citizen and employee. And uh, just thank you for your service, sir. All right. He didn't call the police, but if you did, they would have told you guys that I have the right to be here and I have the right to report in public. Five. And, All right. Yeah. So there's five... This is 10, and 10 is 20. There's your stamps. Thank you so much, sir. Have a, great, have a great rest of your day. Thank you. I'm very grateful for your service for the United States Post Office. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great day. Thank you. Thank you. Very professional, sir. Thank you. Well, there you have it, folks. The new frauditor on the block. And boy, he's a huge ass. He may give Long Island Audit a run for his money. Hell, he might even be the next Glenn Serio.